Hello everybody, Smox here from Celebrant Quest. We're back in Above Snakes. So last episode, uh, we, plan uh, we put down this beautiful windmill, um, completely aesthetic, nothing to do with our uh, plot that I can see. We've also got our lovely well so we can get some water because um, Ayana gets very thirsty. So <laughs> Uh, that's something that's really important. Um, we put a few extra planks, uh, plank foundations down for our hut as well. Um, and I have a view that I would like to eventually be making some garden plots, which would be really cool. So with, um, with our, um, building... Um, I think I won't do these, um, railings, I think they're called. I won't do the railings, um, uh, because I'm not exactly sure how far I want to take this out. And I think we're going to have to extend how far this actual, um, like the covered building extends. I don't know. Maybe I'll make a second one because, um, we don't have a lot of, um, room inside anymore because I also build a piano and a stove so I'm going to take down these trees and gosh my backpack's full <laughs> oh my gosh I always have this problem I'm going to go and make some planks um, and hopefully that'll solve a little bit of a problem that we have because we'll need these anyway make some beams as well May as well make a few more planks. Um, so where did that extra piece go? Or did it uh, despawn? Okay, that's all right. So what do we need to make? Oopsie, you know what I need? I need the workbench. All right, so can we make plank foundation? Okay, we need a few more tin nails. And also, um, I did learn that to get the resin that we need for some other projects, we actually can cut down the birch trees using this lumberjack's axe. I didn't realize. So we will do that as well because I would really like to do that. Um, but for now, we'll place a few more foundations down. Yes, let's do that. How many can we make? Uh, can we... Okay, we can only make four. Alright, well, we'll start with that. So, let's make the four. May as well... Oh, well, it looks like we can do four across here anyway, so let's do that. There we go. Um, and... Let's put our upgraded, our upgraded axe or the lumberjack's axe into our slot for that. We'll run down to the Kachita village, see if there's some clay pots that we can break. And I think what I'll do as well is I think I'll start taking out some of these extra map pieces that we're not necessarily using anymore because it's just making the um it's just making the trip down to wherever we need to be just way too long in my opinion so we'll cut down this tree and see if we can get this my tool is too weak um huh Okay, clearly I was wrong about that. We can't use the Lumberjack's Axe. Mm. Let's see, our Enhanced Axe, I'm pretty sure is too weak as well. Oh, darn. Alright, well. I guess we're not doing that. That's quite annoying. Um, so, what we need to do, though, is we need to buy some ink to take down 
some of the world pieces that have been placed. Um, so I, th I can't recall if Ayana here uh, will sell us anything. But if she does, we'll sell a few things and we will um, get some ink from her. If not, we'll have to go to the trading post and we'll buy some ink because I'm not sure how much I have. Um, and, and also I want to use the feathers for making arrows. So I don't really want to waste them. All right, Cheyenne. Um, do you have anything to sell? No, okay. This is just giving me the quest again. Alright. Let's go. Fast travel. We'll fast travel to... Fast travel to the trading post. Because we've got lots of carrots. Hmm. I don't know what to do about the about the fact that we can't chop down those birch trees. I really thought I found something. I obviously didn't. Um, why am I asking questions? No, <laughs> I need to. I need to ask about mm -hmm. the foods, uh, the goods that you have. Okay. All right. Uh, I got seventy-one. So let's buy a couple. Um, what can I sell to you? Let's sell some of the planks and we'll sell the beams as well. Sell all of them. Um, and let's grab a few more inks. I've only got two. Okay. I've got six now. That's good. Okay. Let's see if we've got a few more carrots around here to grab just so we can use the horse. Okay, there's some carrot over there. We'll grab this cotton. And a little bit here. There we go. Grab this one as well. And one more down here. I'm wondering if I should go back. No, we went to the lumberjack last time, so I can't see why the lumberjack would have anything else for us. Um, okay. We definitely did upgrade our tools, didn't we? Can I do it at the workbench here? No. Where do I upgrade our tools? Is it just in the crafting, like just handcraft? Enhanced pickaxe. That's what we have currently. A bone axe. Okay. Useful at night or in caves or mines. Ooh. Lost soul necklace. You know what? We can make a necklace. Let's go and make some rope. And then we need five lost soul teeth. We've got those inside. I'm sure of it. Um, not there. Oops. Pressing all kinds of buttons. Uh, here we go. Let's take them. I just need five. Was that five? Yeah, beautiful. Let's go make a necklace. That's nice. <laughs> a salty necklace. Um, oh, I didn't need any crafting table for that. Very nice. Oh, I can make a lost salt teeth necklace number two. <laughs> All right, let's equip that. Where do I see my person? Oh, we can make a ring. What's that one there? Don't know. 
2% crit chance. How do I make the other necklace then? There it is. A lost soul necklace and another five rotten teeth. Well, while we're here, we may as well do it. Is it this one? No. No, nope, we don't want to play the piano. <laughs> There we go. Beautiful. Oh, now we've done the third one? Well, you guys know we've got to do the third one. We've got the teeth, we may as well. Right, beautiful. This will be the last one that we can do right now. Alrighty. Let me see. You know, maybe I should create these tools um, just to see if it gives me another blueprint. Uh, Lasso Necklace 3. Yeah, equip that. Let's look at that. Very pretty. Okay. <laughs> Um, I want to get the glass because I'd like to make, uh, I think it was just one, wasn't it? Um, handicraft. I want to make this mono, uh, monocular just in case it actually gives something else. No. Okay. What can I use that for? I might wait till morning and see. Gosh, very hungry and thirsty. Let's see if we can make some food. I'll make a huckleberry bowl. They're very good. Actually, the meat skewers are the best, I think. Well, the fish ones are pretty good too. doesn't look any good. What if you do three? Oh no, you have to have coffee with something else. I'm surprised it doesn't like keep you awake. You can't make thistle tea, that's very strange. Put thistles into teas. Gosh, the cooked honey is no good. Look at all of that. It takes your... <laughs> Takes that away. Alright. Um, oh, we didn't sleep. Gosh, I always miss it. <laughs> it's alright. We're fully rested anyway. Um, okay. So. Um, a dresser. A big dresser. These blank spaces, I wonder if that means that there's extra things to discover on this tier of the workbench. I don't know. Um, do we spend all of our perks? Oh, we haven't. All right, better soil quality. Improve soil quality of your gardens. Crops grow 20% faster. Well, we can't do that just yet. The trading post, buying and selling prices of merchants are 15% better. Iron refinement. Blacksmithing tools improve. Each time an iron ingot is crafted, two are produced. Let's go with that one. Okay, so I need to upgrade my workbench. Okay, for the next level. Um, what? Do, how much of that... Uh, clay did we get? Did we get any? I thought we did. And if I'm not going to use these these equipment pieces, like my old axe and stuff, do I even need to have it in my inventory? Hmm. Let's take care of the world map because I feel like... How do I edit it? <laughs> I feel like this is just getting way too big now. 
like if we could take out half of these um, squares it would just be so much better like why do I need all these prairie squares I'm not going to take them out because that's a waste but do you know what I mean I feel like I could probably change say this piece could change to be here and so the the trading post could be closer that sort of thing not that I need it to be super close but it's more it's more these like Kachita village and everything like can I get rid of these tiles I'm gonna get rid of this pine forest and move the Kachita village up to here so let's see I'm going to remove that piece um, and let's see if I can put I mean this might not work oh it okay I can't put it from here but can I put it like can I move remove Kachita village is okay I'm I might regret this let's do this okay so now if I put the piece down oh great we can move it perfect oh and there's a new <laughs> there's a new pot there that I can get um okay so that's brought the village closer that's I think that's way better I mean this these world pieces are so far away um I feel like I want to maybe get rid of this one and I can move the watering hole up uh, do I even need that there? I don't know. Let's let's do that and um, what do I want to do for now? Maybe put the birch forest there. Yeah, that might be might be better for now. Just for a, I don't know why. <laughs> Um, alrighty, let's go to Kachita Village now that it's super close. Oh my gosh, look, it's right here. That was, that was worth it for sure. Let's grab a few more items. We'll also, um, wreck this clay pot again. Oh, we only got rocks for that. Oh my god, I don't know how we're going to get clay. Um... I guess we'll just have to keep searching and seeing seeing what happens because we definitely need resin to make the boots uh, anything else back here anything in the cart oh there is Oh, canned beans. Nice. <laughs> Can you do anything different at this tannery? No. Resin and rope. Hmm. I need to make two ropes, so I'll make that anyway. What's... Okay, so it appears that if there is something to discover, it's locked. It has the locked symbol. So I need to discover something on this page. What about the bone axe? I don't know. We'll try it. We'll make it when we get home because I don't have any bones with me. These things we still need to discover. Um, I've got my leather armor on already. I haven't made the leather boots. Maybe I should make some leather boots. Leather strips and leather. Let's see. Um, I just need one more of that, didn't I? And, oh, I see. All right, so I need a few more leather strips. Let's make another one. Make two of those. Another leather. Let's make the boots. Huh, that didn't give me anything. Okay. And by making those, I didn't get any, any extra blueprints. Um, this baffles me a lot. <laughs> There's another one yet to find on the sawmill. I mean, the fletching table I can't do until I have iron ingots. And then bronze. So, 
That's, yeah, more of the furnace. No, I can't do anything with those further. Looks like all I can do is sort of trash things from here. Unless I'm going to eat something. Okay. So, let's just look at the map because now I need to orient myself again. Let's go to the birch forest and we'll get a few more resources. I'm going to try to get this deer. He's probably going to run away from me. Oh, yep, yeah, swing and a miss. Well done. <laughs> Hey, that was a critical. Nice. Probably from that beautiful uh, teeth necklace that I'm wearing. <laughs> Just to make sure. Yeah, my the tool is too weak. That's so weird. Um, great. Let's get this deer. Oh, I actually got him. That's weird. <laughs> um, I'm going to just quickly try to fish in this fishing hole. Um, before it gets too dark. Let's see what we get. Because last time we got some scrap parts. Oh, there we go. Some more scrap parts. That was pretty handy. And a catfish. Alright, let's go. Jeez, it's so much quicker to run different places now. <laughs> so, oh, seeing as we move those tiles, that's pretty good. Did we collect the... No, we didn't collect the honey. Alright, so... Let's make some more nails. Can we do anything with the cartography table? Nope. Um, I've made all of those. Oh, look, I can make a rocking chair. That's cool. I wonder... No, I don't know. I was just thinking, I wonder if... Because all these things have blueprint written next to them. I wonder if that means that they lead to another bl blueprint. But I don't think it did when I made the piano or the stove. So I'm going to I'm going to say no for that one. Okay. Oh, we can Wait, we can make an observatory now? Oh, bronze and glass. Okay, we're not up to bronze yet. Okay. Let's rest till the next morning. <sighs> I last episode was having a lot of trouble because I couldn't chop down um, birch trees in the forest and I can't progress through the game if I can't chop down birch trees to get resin. So I went and um, recreated a new axe and now I can actually chop down these trees. Um, which is huge for progression in the game. So now I can get lumber and resin from the birch trees. So I'm actually so happy about that. So now we're going to basically just chop down a whole heap of trees, get some more resin, um, and then see where the game takes us. 
so very happy about that. I think I've got, this will give me, well if it gives me one it'll give me three in total. I believe I need four resin to upgrade the workbench so we'll keep going in this piece of the forest um, just to see what we can get. May as well while we're here. I'm going to kill that deer as well for the hide and I'll try to get this bunny and everything as well. Oops, missed the deer! <laughs> there we go. Because um, we also need the resin for the boots that we've got to craft to get into the snow biome as well. Um, I have also um, gathered a few extra feathers from trying to uh, search these birch trees so that'll give us some extra um... oh my backpack's full okay that's a shame but it'll give us some extra um, ink that we need to basically edit our map because our map is just no good at the moment really um, I'm going to get rid of those branches because I'd rather pick up um, oh that lumber I thought it was resin my bad <laughs> um, okay look let's go home with the resin that we have I have moved everything a little bit closer to my um, my home base here we are with the big windmill so it doesn't take long now to get to the Kachita village and the um, oh, the biome. What does what is that biome's name? Um, this one, the birch forest. I should have known from the birch trees. <laughs> um, okay, so oh my mistake. We can't upgrade our workbench with the resin. My bad. It must just be. It must be something else, but we definitely can make our boots. So let's make another piece of rope and we will make these boots. Finally, the pelt boots. Okay, so let's equip them. We have to return to Cheyenne. Where are the pelt boots? There they are. Um, I might just make a few... Our character is looking so good. Look at her little boots with the hat. That's awesome. Just going to make a few more of these for our um, building supplies because we will need a little bit extra because I... Oh, my backpack's full. Oh, man. <laughs> I do plan on doing some building. So that's why I've made those. Okay, let's dump some of this stuff though because um, I really don't need a whole heap of branches. <laughs> Feathers I will need. Oh, tin. No, let's keep the tin. Antlers I don't really need. Um, what else? Uh, let's put the, put the rocks in there for now. And the beeswax, yeah. Leather strips, the fabric, all the stuff we really don't need to be carrying around, I guess. Okay, let's go and pick up all this stuff before it despawns. There we go, all those wooden beams. Okay. And I'll go and put these wooden beams in the storage as well, I think. If I have space. I mean, I don't know if I have space, but yes, we do. Awesome. Beams in there. Um, we'll put the oh what about miscellaneous yeah look at that put some of the miscellaneous stuff in there um yes yeah, sounds good honey we definitely don't need the honey okay great oh okay I need to drink something there we go okay so I'm really excited. Let's return to um, Ayana. We're going to risk going through the night time because it's only one tile over. So where is she? I think she's in this hut here. Here we are. 
brilliant. Ah, I see you were able to make those boots from my instructions. Very good. These are relative. These are relative simple ones. Should be relatively simple ones, and we will only and we'll only keep you warm for a little while. But like I said, I know some people at the side of the ice lake. They were uh, they are way better at crafting warm clothing. They will have to. Uh, they will have to living in that cold. Go and find the cottage in the ice lake, but better do it fast, else you'll still freeze. Okay. Right, now we get to go to the frozen lake. This is so exciting. I feel like we're, um, we're really progressing now. Alrighty, let's go to our cartography table. And we will, hang on, I think I'm a bit lost. Because <laughs> there's a zombie there. And we're going to research what we need to. Here we go. Oh, look at this over here. Some beams I didn't pick up from earlier. Uh, cartography table, right. Here we go. We need fabric and a winter berry. Now the winter berries are in the cold climates. Okay, so we've got frozen lakes that we need winterberry. Um, all right, so I want to make a few. Oh, I need huckleberry for ink as well. I didn't realize. I thought it was just feathers. My bad. Um, okay. Beautiful. All right, well. You know, I think that we have made a lot of progress. We finally got the resin. We've got our boots. I think we leave it here for today and meet back up in the next episode of Above Snakes. My name's Smox from Celebrant Quest. It's been so great to have you along. If you liked this video, please like, please subscribe to the channel. I've got way more content coming. Um, and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.